The first impressions that I had from Molly, she's quite a powerful cat. She plays quite the rebel. She actually likes affection, but she doesn't know how to get it. I also feel that a lot of the challenges that you have relating to her comes from the fact that she is, uh, what, as I felt, an, an indoor cat. Hi Nancy, uh, looking at your questions, the first one is how can we help you coexist with the other cats in our house? Uh, what I felt from Molly was there is a sense of competition going on here. She also says that there's no sense of loyalty to her. So the next question you have is, how can we help you to use the litter box? And Molly's reply to that was, I can use it. I just don't like it and choose not to. And then would you prefer to be the only child? And Molly said yes. So I think again, it's giving her that space, giving her that individuality that she's wanting there. Uh, so Nancy, what I feel really in summary here is that uh, what Molly's trying to, to, to get across through this reading, she would like to spend her time outside and she would also like to have the support that goes with it so that she knows that you're there, but she's also got the freedom to go outside and do her own thing. After the reading, I haven't seen the behavior change completely yet, but I do feel we have a sense of being able to deal with the problems. The biggest takeaway I got from Michelle's reading would be that when I do have those alone moments with Molly, that she feels that those are our times together and they're guarded and protected from the other cats coming in and that I will also honor that time that we have together that she counts on. Molly saying she wants to be an only child has to be sort of dealt with in the same way a child <laughs> has a new sibling and they don't care for it. You find ways to eventually everyone coexist together. When Michelle said Molly just did not like that litter box, I guess we have to explore the litter, other shapes and types of boxes and things. The one thing that just didn't ring true is that idea of Molly needing freedom, of wanting to be an outdoor cat. She likes the idea of control to get out, but she wants to come back in the house almost right away. Letting her sort of go in and out a little more, like having some time where I take her out, that could be part of our alone time too. I could sort of experiment with that. I'm really hopeful that things will only get better and better for our multiple cat household.